will we go? Who will we be? What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be fun. That much we know. Go, go, kitties, let's go. Go, kitty, kitties, let's go. <laughs> the Kitty Express. What do you want to play today, Kate? I don't know. Let's look in the box. Look, Kate, postman hats. Ooh, we can be postmen. Rain or snow, fog or hail. The Kitty Express will bring your mail. <laughs> <laughs> go, go, Kitty, kitty kitties, kitties, let's, let's go. go! Kitty and Kate jumped out of their magical box and headed off to the post office for their first assignment. Hi there, can I help you? We want to be postmen. Then you'll need to pass the postman's test. Pick up the package at this address and bring it back here before sunset. Uh, there's your deer cart. Good luck. This will be easy. I'll be in charge of the cart, and you'll be in charge of the package. Great. We have to pick up a red package here at this yellow shack. Got it. Giddy up! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Kid and Kate drove like the wind until they reached the yellow shack on the map. Here it is, Kate. The instructions say to turn the handle on this mailbox. Can't catch it! Kit, why didn't you catch it? It's not my job, Kate. I'm the driver. Yeah, but you could have helped. Yuck. Come on, Kate, hop on. It's starting to snow. Rain or snow, fog or hail, the, the Kitty, Kitty Express will bring your mail. <laughs> okay, dear, giddy up. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> there it is, Kit, the post office. We'll be there in no time. But as Kit and Kate headed back to the post office, they noticed that their cart was slowing down. What's going on? It's the snow, Kate. It's too hard for the deer. Let's get out and help. Sorry, but that's not my job, Kit. <sighs> Come on, deer, pull! All this pulling has made me so tired. That's enough for today. Oh, good night. This is terrible. Now we'll never be postman. Then along came a mysterious stranger. What's wrong, kitties? First our package got soaked. Then our deer fell asleep. Now we'll never pass our postman test. Why did the package get soaked? Because it flew over Kate's head. Well, did you try to catch it? No, that was her job. And why's the deer sleeping? He got tired pulling our cart through the snow. Well, did you get out and help so it would be easier? No, that's his job. But now neither of you can do your job. Well, yeah. Oh, I understand. Working together means helping each other. Even if it's not your job. Thanks, Mom. How did you know? <laughs> Come on, Kate, let's try again. But this time, I'll help you if you need. And I'll help you, Kit. Now we know, so back we go. Kit and Kate started their postman test all over again. But this time, when Kate needed help doing her job, This time, when the cart got stuck in the snow... Hang on, kids! I'll help! Thanks. Thanks! Sure! I'm happy to help! There it is, Kit! The post office! Hang on! Woohoo! Rain or snow, fog or hail, the Kitty Express will bring your mail! Congratulations! You passed your test! You mean we're real postmen now? You sure are. Here. What is it? Open it. Our very own mailbags. Wow. And now that they were real postmen, Kit and Kate were ready to deliver help wherever it was needed. Where will we 
we go? Who will we be? What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be fun. That much we know. Go, go, kitties, let's go. Go, kitty, kitties, let's go. <laughs> Safari so bad. What do you want to play today, Kate? Let's look in the box. Look, safari hats. And cameras. Let's go on safari. We can take the first pictures ever of the sneaky sneaker monkey. Yeah. Go, go kitty, kitty kitties, kitties, let's go. Kit and Kate could hardly wait to get into the jungle and take pictures of the sneaky sneaker monkey. Which way's the jungle, sir? That way. Do you have all your supplies? Supplies? Of course. You'll need bug cream for the swamp, hiking boots for the thorny thistles, and a flashlight in case it gets dark. They're over there. Thanks. Do you see the bug cream? No. Do you see the boots? No. Let's just go. Yeah, we got our cameras. We don't need that other stuff. Kid and Kate ran into the jungle swamp. Now where was that sneaky sneaker monkey? There she is! Good thing we didn't wait. Come on, after her! But suddenly, Kit and Kate ran into something they hadn't prepared for. <coughs> Ow! Nipsy flies! Ouch! Stop it! Ow! Ow! Uh, ow! If we only had that bug cream! <laughs> Where did she go? Ow! She went that way. Come on. Ow. Kid and Kate finally got away from the Nipsey flies. There she is. <laughs> Quick, after her. But then they ran into another problem that they hadn't prepared for. Ow. Thorny thistles. Ow. 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 This hurts. <laughs> Ow. Oh, ouch. Oh, she's getting away. Oh, why didn't we bring those hiking boots? She's gone. We're never going to get her picture. Then along came a mysterious stranger. Hello, explorers. <laughs> What's wrong? We wanted to get a picture of the sneaky sneaker monkey, but she got away. Why she get away? First the nipsy flies kept biting us. Then these thorny thistles hurt our feet. You kitties in jungle, you need bug cream and good shoes. We know, but it was taking so long to get them. And we didn't want to miss our chance to take your picture. Well, did you get picture? We never got a chance. Wait, I get it. If you take the time to get ready before you leave, you'll be ready to do what you want once you get there. Thanks, Dad. How did you know? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Kate. Let's try it again. Yeah, but this time we won't leave until we're ready. <laughs> now we know, so back we go. Kin and Kate started their safari adventure all over again. But this time... I found the bug cream. And here are the boots. And I've got the flashlights. Now we're ready. Not quite. Put on your bug cream. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Kid and Kate headed into the swamp. But this time, when the Nipsey Flies tried to nip... Nuh-uh, Nipsey Flies. This time we're ready for you. Oh, bug cream. Brr. There she is. Come on. And when the thistles got thorny... Faster, Kate. No problem with these boots on. <laughs> now, where was that monkey? Look, her sneaker prints. She went in there. But it's so dark inside. No problem. We have flashlights. Oh, yeah. Flashlights on. Hey, why are you following me? We just want to take your picture. Can we? Sure. Here's one for you. Wow, I never saw my picture before. Can I take some of you? Sure. sure. And together with their new friend, Kit and Kate had a picture-perfect day. <laughs> Where will we 
we go? Who will we be? What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be fun. That much we know. Go, go, kitties, let's go. Go, kitty, kitties, let's go. <laughs> Hocus Pocus. What do you want to play today, Kate? I don't know. Let's look in the box. Look, Kit. Top hats. And capes. Let's be magicians. Yeah, we'll star in the Hocus Pocus show. Go, go kitty, kitty kitties, let's go! Kit and Kate jumped out of their box and dashed straight to the entrance for the big show. Wow, look who's in the show, Kate. Oh, they're really good. But we're better. Just wait until it's our turn. Hmm, it's locked. Hey, open up. We're here for the show. Hello. What do you want? We're great magicians. We want you to open the door so we can come in and do our tricks. Well, all it takes is a little magic to open this door. This'll be easy. We know plenty of magic. Behold, as I make this donut disappear. Watch. Voila! That's great, kid, but that's not the kind of magic I'm looking for. Uh, that was a good trick, too. Hmm, maybe he wants us to do some magic together. Yeah, that's it. Oh, what a surprise. Prepare for a wonder. Rise, kitty kitty. Now, rise. That's great, kids, but that's not the kind of magic I'm looking for. <laughs> Kit and Kate wondered, what kind of magic could that guard be looking for? I know! Magic sparkles! Yeah, that's gotta be it! Open sesame! <gasps> Why didn't we think of that before? Hey, where is everybody going? Show's over, kids. You missed it. Over? That's not fair. We wore magician's costumes. And showed him some of our best magic tricks, too. And he still wouldn't open the door for us. Now we missed the show. Then along came a mysterious stranger. Why the long faces, kitties? The guard wouldn't let us into the magic show. How come? We don't know. He said we just needed to do some magic. And we did all of our best tricks for him. We even used magic sparkles. Maybe there's some other kind of magic? Of course, Kit. How could we forget? Magic words. You mean Hocus Pocus? No, silly. Abracadabra? No. Shazam? <laughs> Alaka Bluey? No. I'm joking, Kate. I get it. Please and thank you are the most powerful magic words of all. Right. Thanks, Mom. Mom. Hey, how did you know? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Kate. Let's try again. Yeah, but this time we'll use the right kind of magic to get the door to open. Now, now we know, know, so back we go. Kid and Kate started their magic adventure all over again. But this time when they got to the entrance. Hello, what do you want? We're great magicians. And we'd like to come in and do our tricks in the show. Would you open the door for us, please? Yay! Yay! Um, excuse me, but we can't get by. Just use the magic words. Thank you for opening the door. You're very welcome. Now you'd better hurry. You're on next. And now, the moment you've been waiting for. Oh, please work. Ta-da! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And so with just the right magic words, Kid and Kate opened the door to a truly magical day. Where will we
we go? Who will we be? What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be fun. That much we know. Go, go, kitties, let's go. Go, kitty, kitties, let's go. <laughs> Super duper party pooper. What do you want to play today, Kate? Let's look in the box. Look, Kate, party hats. <gasps> Let's go to party land. Where every day's a party. That'll be fun. Go, go kitty kitties, kitties, let's go. Kid and Kate couldn't wait to get to party land. But when they got there, it didn't look anything like what they imagined. Huh? This is party land? Look. Whoa. Welcome! I'm the Party Land Party Genie! Time to pick our special kitty for the day! Hey! It's me! Yay! Super duper! That means it's your special day! Let the party begin! Wow! I love it! For me? Oh, thank you! Of course! You're the party princess! Hey, what do I get? You get to enjoy your sister's big day! Huh? Now make a wish and blow out the candles. But I want a cake. I wish for race cars. <gasps> no fair, Kit. It's my special day. Hey, what's going on? Sorry, it won't work for you. Today's the party princess's day. Go ahead, Kate. Hmm. I wish for music. <laughs> wow! Go ahead, push the pedals. Hooray for Kate! Kate is great. She's so great, so great, so great. Hooray for Kate! Kate is great. She's so Why, great, so great, so you. great. Hooray <laughs> for Kate! Kate is great. Hey, Kate! It's my turn. I want a song about me. <laughs> This stinks! Easy now, Kit! I'm sure you'll like what's coming next. It's beautiful! Now swing at the shiny star with the wand. If you hit it, wonderful surprises will come out. Forget it! Let go, Kit! No! If I can't do it, no one will! <gasps> you broke the party! Goodbye! Oh, no. Then along came a mysterious stranger. Yo, what's wrong, kitties? We came to Party Land for a great time, but Kit ruined the party. Why'd you ruin it? Because all the special stuff was for Kate, and none was for me. Huh. Tell me, did you ever have a day when you got special stuff? Yeah, my birthday. Huh. And did everyone have fun? We all had lots of fun. And did everyone get the same special things you did? No, only I got the special stuff. Hey, wait, I get it. When you help make the day special for someone else, you help make the day fun for everyone. Thanks, Mom. Hey, how did you know? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Kate, let's try again. But this time, I'll help make your special day extra special. Now we know, so back we go. Kid and Kate started their party land adventure all over again. But this time when the cake came out... Make a wish and blow out the candles, Kate. It's your special day. Yay! Ha-ha! <laughs> and when it was time to make music... Go on, Kate! Pedal! Hooray for Kate! Kate is great! She's so great, so great, so great! Hooray for Kate! Kate is great! And when it was time to hit the star... Go on! Swing, Kate! I can't reach it, Kit. Can you do it? Sure I can. Wait, I can do something better. Go on, it's your special day. This is so much fun! Wow! Thanks, Kit! And by helping to make Kate's day extra special, Kit made the day special for everybody.
what will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be fun. That much we know. Go, go, kitties, let's go. Go, kitty, kitties, let's go. <laughs> Snow lie. What do you want to play today, Kate? I don't know. Let's look in the box. Hey, Kit, what's that? It's a compass. It tells you which way is north. You mean we could use it to go to the North Pole? Great idea! We can fly there with the ducks in a hot air balloon. Go, go kitty, kitty kitties, let's go! Kid and Kate headed straight to their beautiful balloon and thought about what they could do when they got to the North Pole. Maybe we could build a big snowman when we get there. Sure, that'll be fun. Here, Kate, keep the compass safe. I'll go and get the ducks. This is so cool. It doesn't matter which way I turn, the needle keeps pointing north. But Kate wasn't the only one fascinated by the compass. Hey, what's that? Ah! Oh no, Kit's gonna be so angry with me. I better not tell him. We're all here, Kate. Everybody climb on in. North we go to play in the snow! <laughs> now what do I do? Okay, Kate, which way's north? Uh, that way. No, no, I mean that way. Well, which way is it? Just read the compass. Where is the compass? Uh, there was a scary mouse, see? And he stole it from me. A little mouse took that big compass? No, this mouse was big. Really, really big. We have to get that compass back, Kate. Which way did he go? Oh no, he didn't run off. The mouse was huge. He ate it. Kate, you scared off the ducks. Kate, which way should we go? I don't know, but definitely not this way. This is terrible. No compass and no balloon. Now we'll never get to the North Pole. Then along came a mysterious stranger. What's happened to your balloon, kitties? We were on our way to the North Pole, but we ended up here instead. How come? Because Kate lost our compass and then started making up big lies. Why did you lie? Because I couldn't find it, and I didn't want Kit to be angry with me. Well, did lying help you find it? No. I understand. If I had just told Kit the truth, he could have helped me look for it. Yeah, at least that way there's a chance we could have found it. Thanks, Dad. Hey, how did you know? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Kit. Let's try again. But this time, if something bad happens, I'll tell you the truth right away. Now we know, so back we go! Kit and Kate got ready for their balloon adventure all over again. But this time... Hey, what's that? Oh, no. You won't scare me this time, Mr. Mouse. Hey, what's that? Ah! Well, Kit might get angry, but I'm going to tell him the truth this time. I'm very sorry, Kit, but I got scared by a little mouse, and I dropped the compass in the pond. Can you help me look for it? Sure, Kate, but we have a problem. That water's too deep for us. <coughs> you mean you'll go look for it? <coughs> Thanks! Ducks, I'm sure glad I told the truth this time. Me too. All aboard, north we go to play in the snow. And Kit, Kate, and the ducks flew straight to the North Pole, where they finally got that chance to build a great big snow mouse. Snow mouse.